After the very successful Leopard 1 modernization program, Aselsan now presents the Leopard 2 upgrade configuration, Leopard 2 next generation, which is far beyond the Leopard 2 A6 level. This configuration is a state-of-the-art upgrade solution and has distinguishing properties that most of the modern MVTs do not have. Improved fire power with next generation fire control system, electrical gun and turret drives, remote weapon station, improved protection with add-on ballistic protection modules, add-on mine protection modules, improved survivability with laser warning receiver system, battlefield management system, driver's vision system. Aselsan's MBT electronic, electro-optic and electro-mechanical systems are based on today's modern technology and they will be the most up-to-date systems developed, tested and deployed on Leopard 2 MBTs. This will guarantee the utmost life cycle and the minimum life cycle cost to the extent possible. Although all these additional superior features are added to the tank, weight of the tank remains at the same level with Leopard 2A6, thus mobility of the tank is preserved. Now, let's introduce the scope of prototype upgrade a little further. Next generation tank fire control system is an indigenous design of Aselsan, where the main design criteria is to keep the main battle tank in combat to the maximum extent. For this purpose, Developing a non-complex and redundant system has been designed. The main units of the next generation tank fire control system are Commander's Panoramic Periscope, Gunner's Periscope, Commander's and Gunner's Periscope Electronic Units, Commander's and Gunner's Control and Display Units, Commander's and Gunner's Control Handles Inertial Navigation Unit Electrical Gun and Turret Drives Interface Unit and Sensors The system availability is maximized by two electro-optical periscope systems, one for gunner and the other for commander. In addition to these periscopes, search, track and destroy function, each can perform all the tank fire control functions, take over each other's function and also use the other's periscope through its own user interface. Two different and independent superior performance electro-optical periscopes managed by the gunner and the commander directly control and stabilize the gun and turret through electrical drives. With this design philosophy, in case of a failure of one of the two periscope systems, the main battle tank will be operational in the battlefield with full performance, which is a feature that is not possible with the current fire control systems. Variant system functions such as thermal imaging, stabilization, automatic target tracking and ballistic computation will be accomplished by running appropriate software on a standard processor card. By this way, when a processor card of a system fails, another processor card performing a different function of the other system can be used instead. As there are very few electronic LRUs in the new system and these LRUs have identical electronic circuit boards performing different functions, logistic support is significantly simplified. Thanks to the high-end digital technology, 
There are many operation modes and also can be adapted according to their user requirements. One of the most important modes is the search, track and destroy mode. Using automatic searching mode, Commander's periscope is able to observe the targets around independent of the gunner periscope and the main gun. When the commander detects any target during certain track mode, he can take over the control of the main gun and engage target using his own interface just by pressing a button on the handle. As the main gun becomes sleeved to the commander's periscope, commander can either aim and shoot the target himself or hand over the control to the gunner so that the commander continues to seek other targets. Based on the extremely accurate automatic target tracking and moving target state estimation capability, this configuration has a high hit probability against moving targets. Limited period multiplus with first pass reflection capability is especially effective against rotary wing aircraft as well. Aselsan's indigenous remote weapon station works fully integrated with the fire control system. The commander can take over the control of the RWS using his own control and display unit. In this manner, all user interfaces are accomplished by the fire control system, providing the commander with easy usage and reduced complexity. In addition, commander can control RWS by either the commander's periscope or remote weapon station's own optics. The laser warning receiver system, which is also an indigenous product, is another subsystem which works integrated with the fire control system. The laser warning receiver system provides crew to detect any laser beam directed to the tank so that it helps to take counteraction such as smoke grenades and automatic slewing of the gun to the threat direction. DMS shall be an integrated command control system which shall meet internal and external communication and command control requirements of a main battle tank, allow data produced to be shared between elements of tank battalion task force ranging from single tank to battalion level by means of utilization of digital network infrastructure. Together with its 1X magnification front and rear thermal cameras, driver's vision system provides driver 24-hour maneuvering capability under severe weather and harsh battlefield conditions such as fog, haze, dust, smoke, fire or camouflage. Being competent in main battle tank modernization so far, Asesan proved its competency on Leopard 2A4 as well. Together with its experience and know-how, Aselsan is ready for preparing today's main battle tanks to the future.